those guys up there, but they'll come through the dirt after you. Just arrived here at the Blue Ridge Assembly in Black Mountain, North Carolina. I love this place. Here we go. Golly, it's nice. All these summer festivals wear me out. I mean, this is a fall festival. This is the way to roll. I know we lose a lot of people if we don't do it in the summer, but they've made their choice already. Why should we be denied this beautiful weather, right? Of this stuff. Here's Sarah Morgan, <laughs> and Big Bud, and Mama Seafood. Hi. Hello, guys. We're eating German food. Yes. It's Oktoberfest. Ein Prosit, Ein Prosit, der Gemütlichkeit. Ein Prosit, Ein Prosit, der Gemütlichkeit. Eins, zwei, drei, super! <laughs> There's a reason I'm not completely out of shape. Goodness. We got four strings here and I want to talk about basically how to take your three finger chords and turn them into four finger chords. So you've got your L's and I'm just going to use these three strings closest to the floor. I'm going to ignore this one closest to me right now. You got your L's, 002, 113, 224, 335. 
Maybe you got a different fingering. You've got your slants. Oh, one, two, one, two, three, two, three, four, three, four, five. You could do a thumb fingering for that as well. You've got extended slants. Remember, I'm not using the string closest to my face here. Oh, one, three, one, two, four, two, three, five, three, four, six and a half, four, five, seven. And these are not the flipped kind, these are the regular kind. So you want to make sure you're pretty comfortable with these. And then when you get to the four string arena, every one of those can be turned into a four finger chord. So I'll take an L shape like this two, two, four. Right now I'm just using these three strings closest to the floor, two, two, four. I'm going to take this four, move it over to the string I have not been using. So now we have a 2204, oh, which is pretty. But now I'm going to close in that string I just left and make it match the bass. So it's a 2224. Two, two, so as you move over this one on the inside melody string, the string you just left matches whatever the bass is doing. So a 335 three, becomes a 3335. Three, three, a one one three becomes a one 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 three. Slants work the same way, so do extended slants. So a slant would be two three four. I'm gonna move this four closer to me, and the inside melody will match the bass. So a two three four becomes a two three two four. A five six seven becomes a five six five seven. Extended slant. A one two four becomes a one two one four. One two four becomes one two one four. So it's cool to be able to play those four string chords. Um, you can do it with multiple fingers or a bar. Um, but I like what David Schnaufer used to do. So sometimes as he's thinking of this, like a four, two, I'm sorry, four, five, four, seven. It was a four, five, seven. It became a four, five, four, seven. Sometimes he would just let that inside melody string ring open. So I can think of three finger chords, but always leave this inside middle uh, melody string open. So uh, five five seven becomes five five oh seven. Four five six and a half becomes four five open six and a half. Two two four becomes two two oh four. And another thing David used to do is he would leave the bass string open instead. So you take that four five seven on three strings, it becomes a four five four seven four strings and then he would just allow the bass to be empty which becomes open five four seven so I'm gonna call out this is insane but this is how I think about it I'm gonna call out three string chords and in my mind I'm gonna turn it into a four string chord then I'm gonna allow the bass to be open so a four five seven becomes a four five four seven. The bass comes off, makes it an O oh, five four seven. I'm gonna do another one. Four four six and a half becomes a four 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 six and a half. Leave that bass open, and you end up with an O oh, four four six and a half. So just listen to the sounds. Harp scale, instead of playing all the notes on one string, you alternate between the two melody strings that are tuned to life.
So it's neat to just add these in different places. David used to do these cool little triangles like a 424 or a 535, 202, 313. the best chicken I've ever had. Tender, tasty, not overcooked, onions, cheese, rice, goodness gracious. I want to make a hat out of this.